Hey there, everybody. This is Austin, the Best Second of 40 Antiques channel. I got a package in the mail today. Um, I've already taken one thing out so that I could leave the uh, seller a review and just make sure it wasn't filled with candy corn or anything. So uh, I've opened one of the plates that I've received, and uh, there should be four in here. So, so let's see. Uh, let's see what everybody looks like. Give me one moment. Got some uh, bubble wrap here, taped to bubble wrap. So good job, seller. Thank you very much for keeping these safe on your on their way to me. Uh, these are at least a hundred years old. I would think right in that vicinity, if not uh, 120. And I've been pretty lucky lately in finding Kutani ceramic. That was Kutani Ceramics. I don't know if you can hear me over the bubble wrap. <clears throat> so it looks like we're going to have three of these dessert trays. And I think I understood from the pictures that one of these was going to have a, uh, a little pedestal on it. And honestly, the blue. I mean, what a beautiful blue. And to have the birds in the same blue and a little bit of yellow there. You guys into this Kutani stuff at all? So yeah, I've been very fortunate lately in finding some very, very, very reasonably priced Kutani ceramics. And uh, yeah, everything you're looking at right now is Kutani and uh, at least uh, 100 years old. Let's get a little gander at this, because really I... Oh, it's just all in the details, isn't it? I mean, look at that pink flower. Look at that beautiful yellow. Uh, the first one I opened up, notice that. Oh, it's so beautiful. Beautiful, sort of, sort of black background. Nicely enameled flower decorations. Beautifully painted birds. Now listen, without shipping, without shipping, I paid $24 for all four of these dishes. Uh, not the one on the right in the back there, okay? That was a different thing, and that cost me about $13 with shipping. And again, you know, a hundred-year-old thing, beautifully painted and uh, executed. Yeah, okay. Must have just been the one with a foot. I'm sure the seller said that in their... Uh, in their description there, and I just uh, didn't look at it. I got the old ADHD there. I don't know if you're familiar, but uh, sometimes I'll get about halfway through a description and just buy the heck out of something. Because <laughs> I'm just not a smart boy. Uh, I don't know. Oh my goodness. And one did. So these are... Uh, let me Let me rattle this paper real quick. Um, get some stuff put in boxes here. God, these are beautiful, aren't they? Just one second. And sure enough, the last one at the bottom there actually does have a foot. So we've got the same main design, but then it has a pedestal at the base. I don't even know if the bottoms of the others are decorated. Hold on, let me check that. Nope. Nope. That is a Kutani mark, though. If you ever see that, that's a Kutani, likely Meiji era. Sometimes they did mark them that, just, uh, just a little afterwards, not typically. We've still got those Kutani vases behind these. Look at the bright blue flower on this one. That's the only one I noticed that bright blue on. It's also the only one with a, a weird little crack on it. I don't know. Maybe there's something I can do to get that a little better. Maybe run some peroxide through it or something, because because it's so weird. It doesn't even eliminate at the end of the plate there, you see. It's, uh, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, just absolutely beautiful plates. Uh... And man, that blue, is that not just incredible? 
And again, a hundred years old, and they had color like that in their lives. That was beautiful, beautiful thing. So let's look at this a little more. That's pretty interesting. I like that quite a bit. I want even a little, even a little gold detailing in the foot rim there. Oh, and a flower. Are you guys seeing that right? Beautiful, beautiful things. My goodness. There's a green, a pink, and a blue. Gorgeous. Yes, please. $24. I was undercharged for these. Only $40 after shipping, so I mean, still. Still $10 a plate for these. I mean, that's a deal I would take literally every day if I had the money <laughs> and yeah isn't that just a isn't that just about one of the one of the most beautiful little areas of a room you could ever possibly so again look out for this stuff I'm sure it's only gonna raise in value um, rise in value that's probably what I was looking for uh, Kutani ceramics you know I tried to bid on some from um, nice Satsuma vases and stuff and those things are just out of my league I can't afford to buy Satsuma pieces that somebody knows what they are, you know, I just, uh, I can't do it. I gotta, I gotta buy them on the cheaps, be a little sneaky. And, uh, I think that's what I'm doing with these Kutani pieces. I think that one day the value of these pieces is going to elevate quite a bit. So, so keep watching that. See if Kutani, uh, ceramics get more valuable in the future and I can tell you how right I was. And won't that be fun? <laughs> this is awesome, the best I can afford the antique channel. Hopefully, I was showing you something beautiful, showing you something neat.